Hi everyone, this is Nora. I'm coming to you from my virtual music classroom. Um, so today I thought we could do a fun ear training exercise. I know ear training and music can be kind of daunting sometimes, uh, but this is just sort of a fun way to mix it up a little bit. What we're going to be doing is working on um, intervals within a major scale um, and then some musical shortcuts that we can use to help us recognize those different intervals. So in the musical major scale, um, we can use solfege, which is the do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do, or if you use numbers, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight to uh, represent our octave. So in an octave, it would sound like do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do, ti, la, sol, fa, mi, re, do. So that's the basis of our major scale that we're going to be using today. So the first interval that we're going to be starting with is a major second. So a major second in solfege would be do to re, or in numbers, it would be one to two. So it sounds like this. Do, re, one, two. So this actually is the beginning of the happy birthday song. Happy birthday. So if you're ever wondering what a major second sounds like or you're trying to recognize what an interval that's being played is and it sounds like happy birthday, it is a major second. So the next interval that we're gonna be doing is a major third. So that on solfege is do to me or one to three and it sounds like this. So that, in um, music terms, is actually going to be uh, Oh, when the saints come marching in. Oh, when the saints, oh, when, one, three, do, me. So when the saints come marching in is a good song to use as a shortcut to remember um, a major uh, third. So the next interval that we're doing is a perfect fourth. And the perfect fourth is either one to four or do to fa, which sounds like this. And the song we can use as sort of a cheat sheet to recognize a perfect fourth is Here Comes the Bride. So the next interval we're doing is the perfect fifth. Um, this is one to five or do to so, and it sounds like this. Do, so, one, five. And that actually sounds like another very popular song, which is Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star. Twinkle, twinkle. So that's a song that we can use as sort of a cheat sheet for um, the perfect fifth. The next interval is the major sixth, and this uh, is do to la, or one to six, and it sounds like this. Do, la, one, six. And this um, can be recognized by actually the NBC network theme song. NBC. So it is the N to the B of the NBC song. The next interval we're doing is the major seventh, um, and this is do to T or one to seven, and it sounds like this. Do T. So a song that we can use to recognize this interval is take on me. Take on me. So a major seventh is the take on me song. And then the last interval we're gonna be doing is an octave, which is the bottom do to top do, and it sounds like this. So how we can recognize that is actually with the song Somewhere Over the Rainbow is an octave. Somewhere in the beginning of Somewhere Over the Rainbow. So those are a few little shortcuts that we can use to recognize different intervals within the major scale. So a major second is Happy Birthday. A major third is Oh When the Saints Go Marching In. And then a perfect fourth is Here Comes the Bride. A perfect fifth is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. And then a major sixth is the NBC th theme song. And then a major seventh is the Take On Me song. And then an octave is Somewhere Over the Rainbow. So I hope you can use those uh, moving forward with any ear training activities you have. Otherwise, I hope you're staying well and we look forward to seeing you soon at Let's Play Music.